eyes. So, it's been a long time since I've done any videos, but I'm finally back in New Zealand and back into this mess. It's my room at the moment. I'm trying to sort out. It's always a bit weird after having been away for so long and only traveling with a backpack to come back and find just so much stuff. All these things that I don't need. Traveling has really made me reassess what I need to accumulate, you know? I mean, other than my books and maybe my guitars and stuff, there's not really much else that I feel like I need. And half, half of me just wants to burn everything and just, or just chuck it all on a skip. But, um, yeah, we'll see. It's, it's a headache just thinking about it. I met a lot of people who, after extensive traveling, come back and it's just, they have the post-holiday blues, you know, like, you had all this wonderful experiences and this adventure, and then you come back here, and it's like life goes back to normal, and I've, I've been talking to, like, one person who's actually quite sad about it all, and she can't seem to get the grips, she can't seem to get into grips the fact that she's back, she just wants to go again. And for me, I don't feel I don't feel like I feel that way, you know, because I feel like I'm not trying to escape anything. If that makes sense. And so, going away was good, and coming back is good as well, because it's all just part of one big adventure. That's my life, and I really want to learn to treat life like that like an adventure because that's what it is or well, that that that's what I think it is yeah so what does it mean for me going forward I don't really know yet it's not as clear as say for instance when I wanted to go to India when I knew I had to go there after such a long time but at the same time it's kind of exciting not knowing and being able to do anything that you want to do. There's um, a Shakespeare quote from Hamlet. Lord, we know what we are, but not what we may be. And I believe that's true. So yeah, we'll see what happens. Bye.